WBC heavyweight title holder Tyson Fury is claiming a victory of sorts after Anthony Joshua's second round knockout of Francis Ngannou at Kingdom Arena in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia on Friday night. Former two-time unified heavyweight champion Joshua 28-325 was back to his devastating best. Needing to land just five power punches in under six minutes to drop former UFC heavyweight champion Ngannou 0-2. Three times to force the stoppage at the 2.38 mark of the second frame. It was a far cry. From furious effort against the 37 year old Cameroonian last October. In that fight, Nganu had the 35 year old Brit in the canvas in the third round of their 10 round non title bout. Fury 34 0 1 24. Worked his way back into the fight to eke out a razor, thin split decision win. Despite the obvious differences in their performances, Fury says he always knew fellow Brit Joshua, 34, would get his man out of there in the early going. I thought it was absolutely fantastic, it was a fantastic knockout, said Fury to IFL TV after taking in the fight from ringside. I almost got my prediction right, because I had picked AJ to win inside one round, but he got it in two. It was a very rude awakening for Nganu. He got a little bit cocky. It was what it was. He got knocked out. And that's what a boxer should do to an MMA fighter. So credit to AJ, because he did a fantastic job. I expected this to happen. I had said AJ would win inside a round, but I got it wrong today. Joshua's promoter Eddie Hearn said he had no doubt where his man stands in the heavyweight division. You're Looking at the baddest man on the planet, the matchroom boxing chief said after the fight. He's the best. Heavyweight in the world and I can't wait for him to beat Tyson Fury. Unsurprisingly, Fury disagrees. He is due to meet WBA. WBO, IBF and Ring Magazine champion Alexander Yusik 21-0-14, in an undisputed heavyweight title clash in Saudi Arabia on May 18. Responding to Hearn's statement, Fury said, I'm sure Alexander Yusik will have something to say about that, considering that he beat, Joshua, twice. It's me and Yusik who fight for the number one and number two positions and the undisputed championship of the world, in May. I had a shit performance against Nganu. I've never said anything different. Joshua knocked him out and that's what a boxer should have done. Asked if he would prefer to face Fury or Yusik, Joshua was ambivalent. That would be good. But why not fight them both? Joshua said. It shouldn't really be one or the other, I should have. The opportunity to compete with them both and also not just those two, there are so many other fighters I want to compete with. Let's keep on going, I'm not here forever, let's make hay while the sun shines. If there's an opportunity to go again. I'm ready, June, July. 